cold or it's been sitting uh, somewhere where it's been you know sort of low temperature for a while the the instrument will be um, flatter in general um, same with the other way around if I if I warm up in a very hot room a dressing room with those big dressing lights uh, dressing room lights uh, then uh, the instrument will go way up I have to be careful but I certainly don't want to to go on stage uh, last minute with a very cold instrument <laughs> Because I don't have a lot of time and I'm always, I feel like I'm running around from here to there. Um, sometimes I, I just um, developed a thing, it has a terrible title, uh, it's called Killing Five Birds with One Stone. Uh, and what I do is I'll just, it's a combination of scales, um, I'm getting my fingers rolling, my air moving, circulating, um, warming up my instrument, uh, again reacquainting myself with the scales. Then I do kind of a little between each scale, just a little, um, I'll hold the note. Uh, slurring into the next note for, for control. So in a way, I'm, instead of spending 45 minutes on long tones or half hour on scales and stuff, I've condensed it all and consolidate, consolidated it to a 15 minute warm up. And also importantly, very important for me is, is uh, I often say this, we, we don't come out of our mother's womb with, uh, with an instrument in our hands. So it's a very foreign object. So uh, it's, it's, in a way, it's like a bicycle. I mean, I can get up on a bike and I don't have to think about you know, left foot, left pedal, right foot, right pedal. But still, I want to get reacquainted with my instrument, um, given that it's a foreign object. And I just want to feel, again, like, like uh, closer to one as possible. Yeah.